I have any dog training certification? In the traditional sense, as of like going to dog training school or dog training academy, I do not. Um, however, what I've learned is that uh, anyone who's done those courses and stuff, like they actually really don't teach you anything. Um, all my experience is hands-on experience. You know, in the last ten years on walking dogs, lots of volunteer work uh, for humane societies, and then of course uh, what I what I've done as a trainer. It's just like studying on um, studying other trainers' videos, uh, reading books. You know, by um, Caesar Milan, of course, Sophia Yin, Ian Dunbar. Um, oh, there's a couple other trainers that I read their books. Um, you know that that's pretty much where the bulk of my knowledge comes from is mostly experience and then you know some insight from other trainers um, don't get pulled into the whole like oh certified trainer stuff because even people that go to college and get PhDs on animal behavior and stuff like that still unfortunately cannot help you you don't know how many times I myself or my mentor Richard Hines you know went to these people or, or to clients' homes <clears throat> who had worked with animal behaviorists that had all these certifications and stuff, yet the dog was still biting people, the dog was still fearful, uh, you know, just they weren't getting anywhere. And of course, then we come in uh, and we're able to get the dog, you know, into a better place and to help rehab them. So uh, it's just a piece of paper. And to be honest with you, uh, when I first started looking into becoming a dog trainer, um, because my dog Zena herself was a very fearful dog. She wasn't aggressive, but she was very fearful. So like, if you try to pet her, she would like shrink down and like try to disappear. Uh, so I like I wanted to help her. So that's why I kind of uh, 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 branched out into dog training and, and really started looking into it. Um, I did a lot of research online, and then like there was like online sites where you could take courses, and then they would send you off to like work with someone, and like, it was like ten thousand dollars and stuff like that. And so I was like doing a lot of research, trying to find somewhere to learn how to do, you know, become a dog trainer. And uh, I ended up working for a, uh, a corporate pet store, a, a big, big franchise, and ended up being their uh, dog trainer for 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 a bit. So they sent me off to do their training program, in which I honestly didn't learn anything from that from that time that they sent me, um, you know, they sent me off somewhere for two weeks. I was under another trainer, their, their head trainer for the, for the area. And, uh, essentially all we did was read out of a book that I had already read previously, uh, as part of the program. We just simply reread it, um, had nothing to do with dog training. It was like about wolves and like all this other stuff and genetics. And then, um, uh, I got, uh, I, I don't want to say anything. I got no hands-on experience, but I got literally only 15 minutes of working with the dog and like getting critiqued and like that was it. And then they sent me back to, you know, where I was going to work and I essentially had to just learn by teaching myself and like teaching my dogs. So there really wasn't any like formal training. And, and actually, I, I when doing my research for the online courses, for this course that was like $10,000, Someone had posted in the forum that they had also they were they had, they actually did that program. <laughs> they did they did that ten thousand dollar program, and they ended up working for a pet store, uh, much like I did. And everything they learned the pet store stuff <laughs> was the same exact thing as the online course, which was nothing. So I was like, I am so glad I did not spend all that money. I, I, I don't, it would have been terrible, it would have been a terrible investment. So it's just a piece of paper. Uh, my certification comes in all my reviews that you may find on Yelp, Facebook, uh, Google Plus, and Thumbtack. Um, you know, ask anybody that's worked with me, uh, you know, uh, the, uh, that is my certification. It's just that hands-on experience, and of course, the results that I bring to people. Um, other than that, I did study with Richard Hines, Miami Dog Whisperer, who's had over 20 years of experience in dog aggression, uh, who, who works with some some crazy, crazy cases. And you can look him up on YouTube, Richard Hines, the Miami Dog Whisperer, and you'll see. And, I, and I'll be in some of those videos as well. I was with him for three months, 
and I amassed such a great no, uh, uh, um, supply of knowledge, you know, being with him for three months every day, following him around and picking at his brain, asking him questions and just watching him work, you know. Um, so do I have any formal certification? No. Did I go to an academy? No. Uh, but please feel free to watch my videos, uh, look at my reviews, and that itself uh, is my certification.